all right guys it's brian back again um just a quick update on my steering for my recumbent trike um i shot one video earlier on uh just showing you what i've done so far unfortunately i mean i've got a bit of a rubbish setup so i can't film and record uh but to robert uh thanks for the input buddy um i appreciate that it lets me know that there's people that are actually watching and enjoying my videos uh, what I'll try doing is improving the quality and working on my presentation skills uh, so that like you know it's enjoyable to watch uh, in terms of what I'm doing at the moment I'm just trying to figure out uh, how to more or less link uh, my st my, my uh, steering because uh, at the moment uh, as you can see this is uh, from a BMX, I mean, don't worry about all this. I mean, I'll tidy that up uh, once I've done the final build because this is just for mock up. Um, so, what I'm trying to do is uh, figure out how to actually link uh, this steering. So, what so far, what I've come up with, uh, or the idea that I have, is to use these two pieces here. basically weld uh, a nut in there and another one there and uh, so that I can thread this in and out then this side I'll weld another nut as well so that the whole thing is adjustable uh, without uh, taking the whole thing up so in terms of this link piece, how I made it, literally I just took one nut and two bolts, weld them together, so it came out something like this. So this will sit, uh, okay, nut, this, so this will sit in there, uh, so this will sit in there. Uh, central Let's see if I can line it up for you guys so I mean uh, I'm actually sort of going making this stuff up as I go along so <laughs> it's not a well thought out idea yet but what I'm thinking of doing is taking another drop link like this from a car and uh, sticking it in there uh, so I'll chop it somewhere there then figure out how to more or less connect that there so it will be something like this you know so if if you want to adjust your track uh, you can pop this out then more or less turn, turn this then it will either bring the wheels in or push them out uh, instead of actually having to disconnect from this side you know because this is just another ball joint that i got from one of the cars that i've worked on uh, sorry drop links so i've cut it extended it and put in i've cut it extended it uh and just put another and welded a bolt just there so that i can be able to extend it um Alright guys, let me just quickly get back to trying to figure this out and uh, then I'll shoot another video with everything in place. Alright guys, thanks for watching again and please subscribe to my channel and uh, like uh, the videos and press the notification bar so that you get uh, all the videos that I'm shooting. And again guys, I appreciate you all for watching my stuff and uh, letting me know that... Uh, that uh, at least some of you guys are enjoying it because it just lets me know that I'm doing the right thing. Uh, I'll try more or less hurrying up and finishing this thing because it's been quite a long project. Um, I just want to write it now, you know what I mean? And, um, and thanks again, guys. Cheers. Peace.